Hello, it's Thursday, April 2nd. I'm Keenan Smith. Here in Michigan, there are now more than 9,300 confirmed cases of COVID-19, along with 337 deaths. That makes the Great Lakes state in third, the third deadliest spot in the country, only behind New York and New Jersey. Detroit has the most cases in the state at more than 2,400, along with 83 deaths. Meantime, starting today, the city of Detroit will be using new COVID-19 testing kits that reveal results in just minutes instead of hours or days. The city will begin using these special tests on police, EMS, firefighters, and the city's bus drivers. Right now, 91 police employees and 17 fire employees have tested positive for the coronavirus. And more than 6.6 .6 million Americans filed new claims for unemployment benefits last week. That sets a new record for the largest amount of claims in a single week. According to the U.S. Labor Department, around 3.3 million unemployment claims were filed last week. And Ford is working to protect those on the front lines of the battle against this pandemic. On Wednesday, the automaker delivered 40,000 N95 masks to Beaumont Health. Beaumont posted a picture of that special delivery on their Instagram account. Well, today's going to be bright and sunny. We have highs close to 60 degrees, a high of 59 this afternoon. The wind's going to be out of the northwest at about 10 miles per hour. Beautiful weather today, tonight, and tomorrow. It's kind of cold again tomorrow morning in the mid 30s, but tomorrow afternoon, a high of 60. Sunny again. We get increasing clouds Saturday afternoon, light rain showers Saturday evening through Sunday morning, and temperatures stay near 60 through the weekend. Chance of heavier rain Tuesday and Wednesday. Keenan? All right. Thank you very much, Kevin. Don't forget the uh, news is always on 24 7 at WXYZ. Dot com. I'm Keenan Smith. Have a great afternoon.